Good morning to all of our students who are here with us today, along with your family and friends. For anyone watching who I have not met, my name is Aviva Abramovsky, and it's my honor to serve as the Dean of the University at Buffalo School of Law. It is my pleasure to welcome you all this morning to our Virtual Student Awards Convocation for the Class of 2021. Our Student Awards Convocation is an annual tradition where we recognize the outstanding accomplishments of our graduating students, and it marks the start of a day you've all been looking forward to for a very long time, your Commencement Day celebration. And this award ceremony is particularly special. The past year has been challenging for each of us with limited opportunities to gather together as we would all like to do. So it's my hope that everyone watching this ceremony online recognizes this as a symbolic gathering of our law school community to acknowledge the hard work of our students and collectively celebrate their achievements. I hope that each student here today can feel the pride that I feel right now in this moment and know that regardless of how we are gathering, your law school shares your joy. For those of you watching this presentation on Facebook, we encourage you to share your joy throughout the ceremony and participate online with your favorite emoji or a short message of congratulations to our award recipients. It is now my pleasure to turn things over to our Vice Dean of Academic Affairs, Professor Todd Brown, who has the honor of announcing our award recipients. Thank you, Dean Abramovsky. A great deal of effort went into the selection of today's award recipients. Those of us who help make these selections know all too well how difficult they can be because there are many excellent candidates to choose from. On behalf of the Dean, faculty, and the school and the staff of the School of Law, I wish to convey our congratulations to all of the award winners. The first award to pre be presented today is the Award for Excellence in the Study of Health Law, which is presented to honor superior academic performance and encourage student interest in the field of health law as chosen by the faculty. This year's award is presented to Peter James Ferrugia. The Award for Excellence in the Study of Intellectual Property Law is presented to honor superior academic performance and encourage student interest in the field of intellectual property is chosen by the faculty. This year, the award is presented jointly to James J. Hatton and Alexander C. Kazmarek. The Award for Excellence in the Study of Labor and Employment Law is presented to recognize superior academic performance and encourage student interest in the areas of labor and employment law as chosen by the faculty. This year's award is presented to Michael Dolce. The Carlos C. Alden Award is presented to the member of the graduating class making the greatest contribution to the Buffalo Law Review as decided by the law review editors and their faculty advisor. Carlos C. Alden was Dean of the UB School of Law from 1904 to 1936 and a professor of law from 1904 to 1955. This year's award is presented to Kevin Hartnett. The Clinical Legal Education Association Outstanding Student Award honors one law student who has excelled in assisting or representing individual or organizational clients and who has provided thoughtful exploration of legal, ethical, strategic, professional, and other pertinent issues raised in a particular clinic. This year's award is presented to Abby Lee Firkin. The Robert J. Connolly Trial Technique Award is presented to the students who have the best performance record in the course in trial technique as selected by their instructors. The award is presented in honor of Robert J. Connolly, who was an exceptionally able trial lawyer prior to his, high, his tragic and untimely death at the age of 44. This year's award is presented jointly to the following individuals. Mitchell Boughton, Sarah Afoa Jima, Jacob E. Manning, and Brian C. Smith, 
Both Mitchell and Brian are second year students from the class of 2022. They will also be recognized in their commencement program when they graduate. The Court Call Award is given to a member of the Buffalo Moot Court Team, a trial team or mediation team for their academic excellence as well as embodiment of the ideas of the Advocacy Institute by possessing excellence in every aspect of advocacy for their clients. This year's award is presented jointly to the following students. Ryan A. Fortuna and Rena M. Hernandez. The Professor Luis Delcado Award is given to a member of the graduating class whose academic performance in the area of taxation is outstanding, as recommended by the faculty. This award commemorates Luis A. Delcado, class of 1951, a beloved professor who taught tax law from 1961 to 1998 and developed a sequence of courses in taxation taught at the law school. This year's award is presented to Tyler J. Gately. The Monique E. Emden Memorial Award is given to one or more graduating students who are members of groups traditionally underrepresented in the legal profession and who demonstrate a commitment to community service, including significant service in faith-based communities and or have made significant contributions to the law school through involvement in student groups. This, year's, this award memorializes Monique E. Emden, a graduate of the class of 2007, a former associate at Hiscock and Barclay LLP, and a dedicated member of the Bethesda World Harvest International Church. Congratulations to Audiamu J. Anthony. The Maurice Fry Award is given to the member of the graduating class whose academic performance in the area of family law is most exceptional. It is named to honor the memory of Maurice Fry, a prominent attorney who cared deeply about education and who taught at the School of Law. He also worked tirelessly in the community to ensure that our legal system served and protected all members of society. This year's award is presented to Alyssa L. Lograsa. The William R. Greiner Committed Humility Award is presented to the student in the graduating class who, in the opinion of the Vice Dean for Student Affairs and the two most senior members of the faculty, best exemplifies the style of leadership that distinguished Bill Greiner from so many who aspire to leadership today. This year's award is presented to Jessica Tiburcio. The Justice Philip Halpern Award is given to the member of the graduating class for excellence in writing on the Buffalo Law Review. Prior to becoming a Justice of the New York State Supreme Court, Justice Halpern was Dean of the School of Law and member of the faculty for 27 years. The recipient is determined by the editorial board and the faculty advisor. This year's award is presented to Nicole M. Austin. The Professor Thomas E. Hedrick Trees and Forest Award is given to the member of the graduating class whose academic performance in the study of corporate finance is most exceptional. The recipient is the student who most clearly recognizes that a corporate practitioner needs both to understand the transaction fully and get the details precisely correct. This year's award is presented to Jake Circoni. The Judge Matthew J. Jason Appellate Practice Award is presented to the member of the graduating class who in coursework and moot court competition has shown outstanding achievement in appellate advocacy. This award was created in honor of Judge Jason, class of 1939, and is supported by his friends and former clerks. This year's award is presented to Daniel M. Caves. The Milton Kaplan Law and Social Development Award is named in honor of Milton Kaplan, a professor of law from 1965 to 1986. As a teacher and colleague, Professor Kaplan is admired for his selfless dedication to students and colleagues and for his penetrating yet admirably unassuming scholarship. Throughout his career, he was committed to the shaping of law to improve conditions of public life in local communities and around the world. The Milton Kaplan Award honors a member of the graduating class who best demonstrates exceptional commitment to the study of law and social development in an American comparative and international context. 
This year's award is presented to Christina Catoni. The James M. Kiefer Trial Excellence Award is presented to the members of the graduating class whose proficiency in trial advocacy has been most outstanding. Selection is based on performance in both coursework and trial competitions. The award is named in memory of James M. Kiefer, a nationally recognized trial attorney who practiced in Western New York. This year's award is presented to Ryan A. Fortuna. The David Cocheri Award is present, provided by family and friends of David Cocheri, who taught at the School of Law from 1953 to 1980. The award is presented to a member of the graduating class who best exemplifies the traits of community leadership. This year's award is presented to Jake Cerconi. The Lavender Gavel Award recognizes a graduating student for their outstanding efforts and accomplishments in the pursuit of LGBTQ plus visibility, dignity, and civil rights. This year, award, this year the award is being presented jointly. Congratulations to Peter J. Ferrugia and Stephanie L. Verhage. The Professor Virginia Leary Award is given to the member of the graduating class whose academic performance in the area of international law is outstanding as recommended by the faculty. The award is given in memory of Virginia Leary, a beloved SUNY Distinguished Service Professor who taught international law from 1976 to 1999 and developed the sequences of courses and externships in international law at the law school. This year, the award is presented to Rebecca M. Bentley. Hello, I'm Carmen Snell, and it is my pleasure as president of the Minority Bar Foundation to be here today. The Minority Bar Foundation Legal Commencement Award is presented to a graduate who has exemplified the high standards of the legal profession by virtue of scholastic achievement and leadership, and who has demonstrated a significant commitment to effectuating change within the legal system that addresses the needs of the minority community. Congratulations to this year's award recipient, Deja Middlebrook. The Mood Evidence Award is presented to a member of the graduating class for the best performance in the area of evidence as determined by the faculty. The award is given in honor of Wells and Carolyn Moot and in remembrance of Aldebert Moot, who taught evidence in the founding years of the School of Law. This year's award is presented to Catherine Ann Fleming. The Albert R. Mugel Award is awarded to the member of the graduating class who has demonstrated the greatest proficiency in the future interest in future interest and estate planning law. The award is named in honor of Albert R. Mugel, class of 1941, founder of the law firm of Jacob Fleischmann and Mugel. He taught future interest in estate planning at the School of Law as an adjunct professor for over 50 years. During his long career in practice, he served the community with great distinction. This year's award is presented to McCallie Banker. The Ryan J. Mullins Award is given annually to the member of the graduating class demonstrating the greatest commitment to and proficiency in criminal law and criminal trial practice skills. Ryan J. Mullins, a member of the class of 2005, died suddenly in September 2003. To honor his memory, his classmates, family, friends, and members of the law school community established this award. Congratulations to this year's award recipient, Courtney L. Bow. The award of Barristers is a National Oralist Honor Society. The members include students who have shown dedication and have excelled in the art of oral advocacy and service to the Moot Court Board. Each year, 10 students are elected to membership in the organization. This year, the new members are Adam W. Amaro, Nicole M. Austin, 
Daniel M. Caves, John M. Conti, Leah N. Farwell, Lucas J. Froman, Joseph B. Fumarelli, Mackenzie E. Hamill, Brianna N. Kralzik, and Rebecca A. Valentine. The Harry A. Rackland Prize in Real Property Law and Real Estate Transactions was established by the family of Harry A. Rackland, class of 1926, who during his lengthy and renowned career was a leading authority regarding New York State lien law. Mr. Rackland served as a lecturer and maintained an ongoing interest in the welfare of UB law students. The prize is awarded to the members of the graduating class who exhibit excellence in research, clinical, and academic performance in the areas of real property law, housing, housing finance, and real estate transactions is determined by the faculty and administration of the School of Law. This year's award is presented to Stephanie L. Verhage. The Judge William J. Regan Award is given to the member of the graduating class who has demonstrated the greatest proficiency in estates and surrogates law and who is motivated by a strong concern for public service and public welfare. The award is named in honor of Judge William J. Regan, class of 1938, Erie County surrogate from 1963 to 1981. During his long career in practice and on the bench, he served the community with great distinction. This award is supported by a fund donated by friends of Judge Regan. This year's award is presented to Deja Middlebrook. The UB Law Alumni Association Gold Group Award is given annually to the member of the graduating class who has demonstrated outstanding leadership skills in advancing the mission of the School of Law and enhancing its reputation for excellence in legal education. This year's award is presented to Aldiamu J. Anthony. The Cornelius W. Wickersham Jr. Award is presented to the member of the graduating class who is the highest ranking student in the field of constitutional law. This award is given by the Federal Bar Council. The Federal Bar Council was formed in 1932 after breaking away from the National Bar Association to protest its refusal to admit minority members. Mr. Wickersham was its president from 1955 to 1957. This year's award is presented to Kevin Hartnett. Hello, my name is Jamie Leberer, and I'm the president of Women Lawyers of Western New York. The Women Lawyers of Western New York Award is presented to an individual who contributes to the advancement of women in our society, promotes the issues and concerns of women in the legal profession, and demonstrates academic achievement. On behalf of the Women Lawyers of Western New York, we are proud to announce that this year's recipient is Aldiama Anthony. Congratulations. Our final award of the program is the Order of the Quaff, which honors the top students from the class of 2021 for their scholastic achievements. The Order of the Quaff is an honorary scholastic society whose philosophical roots stretch back to the medieval English jurisprudence. Quaff membership is offered to graduating students who display excellence in legal education by demonstrating a spirit of careful study and academic success. New members who demonstrate such scholarly success join lawyers, judges, and teachers who have continued to attain high distinction for their continued scholarly or professional accomplishments. UB School of Law has been a member since 2014. Congratulations to our newest members of the Order of the Quaff. Christopher J. Bartz, Rebecca M. Bentley, Catherine E. Katsuba Blanchett, Daniel M. Caves, 
Trent J. Citarella. Janie Sandra Tamara Doe. Michael M. Dolce. Ryan A. Fortuna. Lucas J. Froman. Joseph B. Fumarelli. Tyler J. Gately. Kevin Hartnett. Jordan J. Kilijansky. And Elena M. Spence. Thank you and congratulations to all. And now please welcome back Dean Abramovsky for closing remarks. Before we end, I believe it is fitting and just to recognize and express heartfelt gratitude to all of you who have been instrumental in the success of today's award winners. Congratulations to the families, friends, and support network who are watching and commenting on today's ceremony. I hope you share a sense of pride and accomplishment, just as you've shared in the sacrifices necessary to help your student reach today's milestone. Thank you also to our community partners who have made many of these awards possible and who recognize the exceptional talent of our students. And finally, to all of our award recipients, I applaud you. You demonstrated excellence throughout unexpected adversity and challenge. As you embark on your legal careers, I look forward to watching each of you emerge as leaders in our community. I take comfort in knowing that our future is in your hands. Remember to do justice and remain UB strong. Congratulations and thank you.